Joining me right now is Larry Zook, President and CEO of Landis Homes. Thanks so much for joining me, Larry. It's wonderful to be with you. Tell us why social media sites like Facebook and Twitter are so important for your industry. Well, we at Landis Homes find it very helpful because uh, trust and communication with our residents, with family members, with caregivers, uh, it's just so very, very important. And social media is another means by which we can communicate, can develop trust between those constituencies that we serve. So how has your organization been using social media and other emerging technologies to enhance your brand? Well, uh, again, it goes along the line of relationships and communication. Uh, it's provided an opportunity for us to get to know family members of residents that we serve. Uh, to connect with other local constituents. For example, just recently, we connected with a pastor of a local congregation on Facebook, made some connections there that resulted in a seminar that we both sponsored about flu prevention and awareness, reached out, partnered with others in the community and met a community need. All that arose out of a Facebook friend connection. Why should other ASA members embrace social media? Well. Again, it's part of a, a multiple layer of communication. For example, um, we've used print media. We've used magazines, letters, mailings over the years. And, and then more recently, we entered into space like the internet, websites. Websites are more one-way communication. Uh, social media adds a whole additional dimension where there is more of a two-way communication, more of a community building, more of a community experience where people can connect with each other, can learn from each other. And finally, what has the response been from your residents when it comes to social media? Are they engaging it? We have had uh, a number of residents on uh, social media sites like Facebook. Uh, just last week I was speaking with a resident who uh, in the last year had a hospital experience. She used her recovery time to get on Facebook. She connected with her grandchildren. She connected with uh, nieces, nephews. Her husband passed away recently. This has opened up a whole new world of connecting with, uh, with others. And she said just the other day she had four or five Facebook friend requests. And she said she's loving it. So uh, being able to support residents and support prospective residents in connecting with our community just I think is a wonderful opportunity. Um, and we're just thrilled about it.